everyone it's your girl me viva and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to yet another reaction video so y'all already know by now that we are getting cottage living as our expansion pack number 11 for the sims 4 they already did like a reveal trailer and today in about four minutes or so they about to reveal the actual gameplay trailer so i know y'all want to see me do a reaction video to it so that's what we're going to be doing today so let me know how y'all feel about college living let me know if you're going to get it in the comment section below after you see this trailer so let's get into it y'all already know what i'm about to do we on the official the sims youtube channel and it's starting the premiere is starting very soon we're gonna jump up in it it says well, i'm gonna tell you about the sims 4 cottage living so let's get into this reaction okay so we about to see the trailer in like five seconds so let's see what it's about y'all hopefully it's not too loud hello viewer i'm harold yes i'm a llama and no i How don't cute. have an explanation for why you hear a voice in my head instead let's focus on the point of this video which i'm telling you now over the next 180,000 milliseconds, or three mins, I'm going to show you how to get your cottage living lifestyle tight. So let's eliminate the I like the, the narrative of them of talking through the llama. That's so cute. So I might not talk in. that much because I'm trying to listen. Welcome to Bagley, the hob. It boasts the rustic appeal of living in a cottage in the woods with the nearby convenience of a modern day village. I love the world, by the way. Cozy it's so shops, cute. delightful villages, and a tolerable level of activity make for an inviting place to live out your wildest fantasy. Of course, I'm referring to canning. If I had thumbs or any number of fingers, I can't wait to do the canning. Do. It's going to be so cute. Varietals of jam, custards, 16. and veg, all jammed in a jar That's that can lot. be kept for cooking later. Some, like the mouth watering lettuce conserve, will entice you to eat it on the spot. If you can contain your craving, gather your cans or any of your favorite consumables for consumption into an easily yeah, placeable picnic, got picnic that makes I can't wait to have little picnics. I think it's going to be the cutest little thing ever. Not courage enough? Fine. I'll give you the wool off my back to cross stitch with. If you're not feeling confident enough to stitch for reference, cute. there's over 34 designs to prick your poopers on. Nice on. Handful of good looking let's move on to the real in this trailer. I'm here. impressed. The hot, hot world of garden to tabes. One of the benefits of living in the countryside in a seductively charming cottage such as this is the equally alluring ability to grow your own food. And not the pre-packaged porcinis you buy at the store. These oversized crops will make even the most professional garden a blush. <laughs> in a natural transition that I'm currently accomplishing, let's discuss an activity everyone wants their hands dirty while like doing. It Cooking. just looks so beautiful, y'all. It looks the so beautiful. The simple living lot challenge will make that magical fridge that's always full obsolete. Lot challenges. Now, a simple living you'll have off to the face grid the facts of foraging boxes. for your ingredients yourself. Sorry? When Gran Gran comes over for your mildly famous Yorkshire pudding, simply grab some eggs, borrow some milk from your cow named Tater, and mix together with flour from the local grocer. Oh, I need a cow there tater. were many that's other cute. options that took too long to show being made, so please take a look at them now. All the new foods. Moving on to something I resemble. Animals. We love animal animals. Shed. What it lacks in interesting naming, it more than makes up for in its ability to confine animals to a space. Place it anywhere on your land and choose a cow, or the better option, llama, to inhabit Not it. better option. We eat here, <laughs> the sleep shade. here, and yes, die here. It's the perfect place for a romantic Ooh, gesture. new woohoo, y'all. Look at it. New woohoo Let's in the animal shed. Let's made the horrible mistake of choosing cow and did not immediately trade it for animal treats. Now that you're waist deep in the proverbial cow shiz, you'll have to navigate the oddly satisfying it's waters such cute of the this bovine it's buddy of yours. Keep their mood level up if you want to have the tastiest milk game in the hob. Try different animal treats to create flavors that are so delicious. I want that rainbow cow so bad, y'all know that. Don't yeah, I know I want that rainbow cow. It's definitely going to happen. This cock and bull story continues, y'all. The chicken coop offers the ability to domesticate up to eight fowl feathered the friends They're so cute. Coop. An apex animal. The chicken has no known predators. Do y'all see that chicken have fire coming out of his foxes. eyes? The coop Swipe can the be fox. equipped with Yo, the fox if you could name a clever upgrade that triggers the an alarm foxes, whenever those hands definitely even name one swiper. Try their eggs. One way to truly embrace the cottage living lifestyle is in one obviously direct way. Compete in the Finchwick Fair. I'm here Whether for competition. You have or egg, cow or milk, Crop Look at the cute little outfits they have. They got pies you, in here. But it's oh hard my gosh. to call it fair. Yes, llama skirt through pride. Town. Even though pride just ended, so still gonna represent pride. The lifestyle for you. 
As a llama who knows little else about the world, I'd say probably. <laughs> that was a cute trailer. I really enjoyed it. So if you buy the pack before September 2nd, you get all those things. And of course, Cottage Living is coming out July 20th. Second, so let me gonna run it back. I'm actually gonna play it normal speed because it was actually a four minute trailer, which is wow, right? Crazy, right? But everything about this trailer, I love. I said this before, and I'm gonna always say it that whoever is their department and their team that create the trailers, they do their job absolutely well, they know how to make a very good trailer to sell whatever pack that they're selling to the consumers i'm just saying like the world is beautiful we have all these animals like the narrative through the llama saying that the llama was the better animal <laughs> throughout this whole pack and throwing shade to the cow it was cute i love it like i i just cannot wait to get my hands on this pack for y'all do some gameplay like i'm for it like the canning that's new you see that you could have picnics that's new that's cute got chickens llamas cows foxes rabbits birds uh everything but a horse but um horses just wasn't meant for this type of pack it was more for like a cottage field and uh, a horse is not really i guess not on brand for that type of thing but there's cross stitching which i'm sure that's a new skill like and i like i applaud them for this trail like there's a lot of good looking sims in this trail I'm like what oh, wow interesting <laughs> there seems to be a water tool that's coming as you can see how they created that little pond right there like what it's like so much going on and this definitely like give me like stardew valley vibes <laughs> for some reason like if you want to play out like a stardew valley type of thing uh this is the pack for you there's also like family cooking the kids are cooking i love that we have a lot challenges now which i'm sure will be great to do uh add a little bit more challenging to the type of lot that you're living on which i'm sure people love and it's so cute like look at the animals the animals have clothes on them and i love that this scene right here remind me kind of like a generations type of scene we have a whole bunch of new foods like wow 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 the trailer sold me and they did kind of sneaky peeky showed off a new woohoo that came in the pack and that's with this animal shed right here they showed it off a little bit later after this point so new woohoo animal shed perfect and um they showed a little glimpse of your animals dying with the grim reaper or the grim reaper i'm pretty sure the grim reaper is not there just to hug the llama they dare because the llama is dying so sadly our animals will die but I, it's a cute way it's not a harsh of a way of them you know going <laughs> and i like the cute little interactions with all the animals <sighs> All the animations are cute rainbow cow for the win for me definitely getting it as soon as i get my hands on this but let me know in the comment section did this trailer win you over are you interested in getting cottage living look at those cute little chickens they kind of look almost real like the texture on them it got like a demon chicken like what is going on but let me know if this pack sold you i know this type of thing not might be for everybody you know like some people might not like this type of thing excuse me might not like this type of thing but let me know in the comment section are you getting it i would love to know you saw that rainbow egg i didn't even see that the first time i'm just obsessed with rainbow anything in this bag like look at come on now come on now come on i'm here for all type of competition i'm trying to get all medals like i'm here for this i am here <laughs> for this but let's pause right quick right here in case y'all didn't see this before if you go ahead and buy the pack before september 2nd you would get these three bonus items you would get this rideable bike even if you know how the bikes came with university life or what was it was it university life or was it university living what was the name of the university pack oh my gosh it was like so long ago 
but it came with university okay so um you don't even need to have the university pack in order to be able to ride bikes if you buy this pack before september 2nd you'll be able to ride a bike okay you get this little gnome statue it don't ride in the chicken because we've got chickens in the game now if you get the pack and we have this lighted tree which is so cute and i love that and of course the pack is coming out july 20th second i'm going to try my best to get my hands on it early to provide some type of content on this for y'all and i may or may not do a new let's play <laughs> i don't know let me know if y'all want me to do a let's play on this back in the comment section below as well so anyways that's my reaction to the cottage of living gameplay trailer uh like i said pack comes out july 22nd if you what 40 dollars i believe right 40 something like that yeah so anyways i hope y'all enjoyed this video check out all my other videos okay just do it anyways <laughs> i hope y'all enjoyed this video don't forget to like this video up right now if you haven't already and subscribe to my channel if you're new follow those links down below and i will see y'all in my next video bye